Hey guys, so I've got my plate set up. This is this is my favorite plate. I usually only eat out of these or um, uh, these. So you can kind of see the size. So I typically only eat out of this plate or this plate. And the only, yes, lots of rainbows. And the only reason I eat out of this plate is when I have more than one item that I don't want touching. I'm really strange about that. So, it is 3.12. I've had zero to eat. And um, I even have my coffee made over here, which I haven't drank yet. Coffee. <coughs> no mute button. <coughs> okay. So... Let me show you what I'm going to have for breakfast slash, well this will be breakfast-ish. So I have some non-GMO gluten-free hummus. I don't know if it's vegan. I Soybean garlic salt, but I don't see the V for vegan. I don't think this is vegan. I think something in here must not be, yeah. Okay, well, it doesn't say vegan, but I know there's plenty of vegan hummus. So, I've only used this like once. <laughs> so, I might want to get on it. So, I have some baby carrots here. Now, I'm going to tell you right now, I will not digest any of these, but I will digest the hummus. So, this is just a carrier. Who? Eating said hummus. I don't know how much of this food I will get in, but I'm going to try very hard to eat most of it. Um, as much as I malabsorb, I believe my body is somewhere in between like, like starvation. Um, there, I, don't, I can't eat that one. What the hell am I doing? Um, I just, I'm not sure what's going on with me. Um, actually, that, that, that's good. This is good. That's good. Um, one more. Okay. Here we go. Yay! I'm gonna do a pretty Instagram plate. No, no. That's a damn lie. I still eat with baby spoons. I do. I still, I still eat with baby spoons. You won't see me eat without a baby spoon unless I'm in somebody else's house who, you know, obviously isn't bariatric or doesn't eat with those. It's just something I picked up and something I've never been able to change or wanted to change. And like I said, the only reason, and I'm going to smear this, so I'm going to smear it. I'm going to mix it up just a tiny, tiny bit. And the only, only real reason I'm even using uh, these plates is when I have, of course, one, you know, that's a good tablespoon. Oh, you guys probably want to know the stats, don't you? Mm. Nom, nom, nom. Let me see. And there you go. And I have one, a little over one tablespoon. Serving size is two. Tablespoons. So we'll put that over here out of the way. Now then, I've got those and those. This is gonna be my main. So it is chunk light tuna and sunflower oil here are the stats for that. You guys are gonna see things with fat in it. I don't think I need to explain it, but 17 grams of protein, um, yeah. I'm only gonna do half. So open it. There's 150 calories per package. Again, I don't really like to buy the, um, uh, I don't really like to buy the ones in water. I like, I would prefer um, this to be in these packages. It just feels fresher to me. I don't know. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I have no damn idea. So, if you are very new to my channel and you are just clicking on this thinking that I'm a typical bariatric patient. I am not. Um, 
If you're looking for lunch ideas, except for the fat content, I think this is a really good, 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 good meal. This is something that I'm, I'm perfectly happy with. You know, let's see. I'm trying to, oh, can you guys see that? No, you can't. Okay, so I also have some Clausen's pickle sandwich slices. This one we're using as my bread type thing. I think I'm only going to be able to do two, and then I'm going to be like, nope. So two looks good to me. There we go. And uh, pickles, stats. I know there'll be one person. What are the stats on the pickles? It's a pickle. guys look so this is my favorite this is my absolute 190,000 favorite um, if you have a Safeway or any of those kind of places and you can find this uh, yeah so this is Greek olives with feta here are the stats before I even open it okay focus okay so one ounce uh, 80 calories but that's mostly just the oil. So if you if you shake it up, um, which you really can't do after you've opened it, and I'll show you why. Um, there's a cling film right here. So once you've opened it, you really can't shake it. So there you go. And then, mm -hmm, yum. And then all I'm gonna do is, man, this one had like. God, wow, that's a lot of, that is a lot of cheese. Okay, don't mind if I do. Okay, a lot of the cheese will kind of settle onto the plate. So you don't actually have, no, cheese. A lot of the um, oil will settle on the plate. So you don't actually have to eat all that oil. I actually prefer um, these olives more than I do those, but they give you a message of both. Did I drop one on the floor? No, I think it, I, it's on so that looks good enough to me. And then that one's kind of just hanging out. Then you just put your stuff back on. You know what my favorite thing about making food is? The mess. That's what I mean. I just love it. Love it. And the very last thing I'm going to do is put a little mayonnaise, salt, pepper. More than enough. Probably too much. I'm going to do salt, I'm going to do pepper, I like pepper, and then I also have an entire bottle of this, 40 ounces of this. Um, Sugar-free energy with straw. It's like wild strawberry. It's delicious. I also like the crystal light brand. So there we go um, I don't think this is Instagram worthy at all. I think people will be like the hell are you eating? but oh well so um, Did they like wipe their plates and shit like <laughs> I think this will be funny for some of y'all. I'll be like um, all the shit that goes into those Instagram posts, y'all, like, these people standing on top of chairs and, like, being all, you know, like, the lighting has to be right, the food has to look its freshest, like, you know what I'm saying, like, We'll see. We'll see what this looks like after I clean it up a little. And then you guys can tell me. I'm going to post it on Instagram anyway. <laughs> and see what y'all think. But you won't see this video until probably a couple hours from now anyway. See what a pain in the ass it would be? Unless you've had food that's properly made from, by somebody else. Like if you wanted to be like super popular I guess on Instagram or whatever with your food meats then you would probably do a lot better job than me a lot better job 
spoons are ugly. Gotta remove it. Okay. So I think that will do it. Mm -hmm. And there is my breakfast slash lunch. Big ass cup of coffee. 40 ounces of water. Um, I might have this meal for dinner as well because I saved half of the uh, tuna. If I really like it, I will. So there you go. So after I got it mixed up. Okay, here's what it looks like. 